Hey guys, so I'm doing a new video today on um, my two month septum piercing update. Um, so yeah, it's, well no, two and a half month septum piercing update. I got it done on the 20th of May. Um, and yeah, I haven't had any problems with it. Um, I did get scar tissue, which is normal for fresh piercings. Um, but I can, I don't really have any more pain with it anymore. Um, it can sort of get sore sometimes if my boyfriend headbutts me by accident. Um, but that's okay. He does it by accident, so it doesn't really matter. Um, yeah, sometimes it would like knock the tip of my nose like right uh, here, and it like really hurts. So um, yeah, that's the only problems like I have with it now. If I get it knocked or something like really hard, but um, apart from that, it's doing great. Um, it's fine now. Like I don't really need to clean it that much anymore. Like I don't get like crusties or anything anymore. Um, but if I do wake up to little um crusties and stuff. Uh, then I will use my method of the tea tree and almond oil with a q-tip, clean around it, and yeah, um, yeah, I just wanted to talk a bit about it, um, how I'm, I've experienced, how this two and a half months experience of my fresh septum piercing has been. Um, basically, yeah, it, it's been good, um, I think the first month it was incredibly sore, um, I couldn't move it move move it that much um but yeah sorry if i keep on looking out the window i like looking at the sky it looks really pretty um sorry about that uh but yeah and sorry if it looks a bit of a messy behind we were like in the middle of cleaning today kind of got a bit do you ever find it where you're cleaning and it makes it more messy because you're trying to yeah just okay carry on um <clears throat> but yeah now it's completely fine like wait i'll zoom in on you on it Sorry, I've broken out fairly badly recently, and it's not looking its like my skin's not looking its best at the moment. But um, let me get you in a bit more better lighting. There we go. Right. So yeah, here it is. Uh, um, yeah, it. There it is. There. All right. So that's it there. Um, that was just a quickie close up. Um. But yeah, um, and yeah, I don't really have any more problems with it anymore. Um, I clean it occasionally. Um, don't really feel the need to anymore, to be honest. Um, yeah, it's doing great. Um, I think I'll do my next one at five months um, or something like that. Just, um, I'm not sure. Uh, sorry, went in focus. Um, but yeah, I might do it at like five months or four, I'm not sure, four or five months I'll do my next septum piercing update. As, um, yeah, that's when I heard that's when they like fully heal and stuff. Um, like completely fully heal where you can like start taking that on, actually like leaving the piercing, the jewellery out. Um, yeah, it's actually doing amazing. Um, it's been very good to me because I heard most people have incredibly hard time keeping it um, like not infected and stuff. Um, let me move you down a bit. Um, they find it incredibly hard to keep it like clean and um, keeping it like ma maintaining it and like trying not to knock it and stuff. My cartilage is still not healing. Um, I might have to get it checked out. Um, I did mention that in my last septum piercing update, which is I think my yeah month one month septum piercing update. Um, I keep knocking it a lot. It's still sore, but like it's just not healing. Like I can move it and stuff. It's just incredibly painful still. Well, not not incredibly. Like it's just I don't know. It just won't heal and. It's, I've got it like two months before this, my septum, and my septum's done more, and you would think this has got more of an infection of getting one, because it's like up my nose and stuff, but um, yeah, um, yeah, it's done amazing, not my cartilage, my um, septum, it's done really well, I'm really happy with it, and um, yeah, so if you have any more questions about my septum piercing 
or any other piercings that I have. I have all these up here. The no a nose septum, obviously having camera issues. Um and my belly, obviously. Uh, trying to bend down. There we go, and that's my belly. Um, I have that coloured belly ring in because of my hair. It is pink and blue. I have a pink and blue belly bar in, and I just thought it would match everything. But um, at the end of this video, I wanted to give a huge shout out to one of my YouTuber friends. Um, I will. He right. I'll get it up. I'll get his channel up so you know what he looks like um, and know which picture you click on to find it because he is um, he does YouTube videos obviously um, he's a really good youtuber um, and I'm trying to build his subscribers up because he is such a nice person um, and yeah I think you would enjoy his YouTube videos um, so let me just type him in Here it is. <clears throat> here he is right here. Um, be sure to check out um, and try boost his subscribers up. And yeah, because I would really appreciate if you did, um, as he is such a good friend of mine and um, does really good YouTube videos as well. Um, and yeah, so if you could go do that for me, that would be great and if you could go subscribe, subscribe to me as well if you're new to my channel then please go subscribe comment like this video if you found it helpful in any way or enjoyed this so um thanks for watching guys bye